And what more do we know about this listing? Yeah, this is a keenly awaited listing. It's one of the biggest SPAC deals ever valued at about 40 billion. And it was finally approved by Altimeter shareholders um, overnight yesterday. And uh, Grab will start trading today in the NASD on the NASDAQ, so that's really exciting. Um, the, the SPAC deal was actually delayed from the third quarter to the fourth quarter um, because the company had to work with the SEC over some uh, audits for its accounts over the past three years. And that's finally, that seems to have come through now, so investors are going to keenly watch this debut today. And how far we'd come, it's almost just like yesterday that you know, it was named Grab Taxi, and here we are. Uh, talk to us about the current challenges the company's facing given its objectives. Yeah, uh, so it's a pretty challenging environment for the company right now, especially with the Omicron uh, variants discovery. Uh, it's already been affected by the Delta variant because it operates mainly in Southeast Asia, where most of the economies have reopened fairly slowly compared to the rest of the world. Uh, it already cut its revenue projections for 2021 before the spread, uh, the Omicron variant was discovered. And uh, its revenue declined actually in the third quarter and uh, its net losses widened as well to $988 million. So it's a challenging time, but our Bloomberg intelligence colleagues seem pretty um, positive on the company. And they think it's going to maintain its market leadership over Uber and DoorDash. And uh, they see the company valuation reaching about $35.5 billion from its pre-money enterprise value of about $30.4 billion. So they're pretty optimistic about it.